Welcome to our tiny camper. This is the place that takes us on so many adventures, a cozy place to sleep at night, and most importantly, it's our home. Our micro camper is a 2017 Honda Pilot SUV. It's not a typical small camper, but it's the perfect vehicle for us. On the outside, our camper looks just like any other vehicle, allowing us to park it almost anywhere overnight and be super stealth. But if we're in a spot that allows camping, we can really spread out and even set up our tailgate tent for a bit of extra space. Our micro camper has three modes, drive mode, living room mode, and sleep mode. Obviously, we use drive mode when we're driving. In drive mode, all of our belongings are secured under a cargo net, but we can still easily access our clothes if we happen to drive by a beach and want to change into our swimsuits for a quick dip. Drive mode also keeps our kitchen area fully available to us if we want to pull over and make lunch. And because our stove and table are right there, making a hot lunch is no problem. We use living room mode when we're stopped somewhere for the night or when we're parked at camp for a few days. In living room mode, we can use the Honda Pilot's second row of seats as a sofa. We can sit inside to have dinner on a cold or rainy night, watch TV at the end of an adventurous day, or just take a few minutes to unwind in the middle of a busy afternoon. Because of our fans, window covers, and ventilation system, we're comfortable inside in a wide range of temperatures and weather conditions. And lastly, sleep mode is for when we go to sleep. It takes us less than a minute to convert from living room mode to sleep mode, so it's super easy to stay up watching TV in the living room, then get up to brush our teeth and convert to bed mode, and then go to sleep. Our clothing shelf and clothing are always accessible to us, whether we're in living room mode or in sleep mode. As I've already alluded to, the kitchen area is off the back of our vehicle. This area is divided from the living room and sleeping area with a cardboard wall so that we can keep the kitchen area open during the day while greatly reducing the number of bugs that fly into the main section of the micro camper. I really love how the camp kitchen is always available to us. Our kitchen area has six sections. The first section is the charging section. This is where we charge the bulk of our batteries when we're driving. The next section is the kitchen dishes and cookware area. This is a clean drawer where we keep anything we use to prepare or eat food off of. Then we have a catch-all drawer. This is the space we use to store most of our camping equipment like first aid kits, camp stoves, flashlights, and games. In the middle of the kitchen area, we have a water section and sink area for refilling our water bottles, cleaning our dishes, and washing our hands. There's also a spot underneath the water jug to store our dry food. I know it doesn't look like a ton of space, but we can get about a week's worth of food in there. And on top of the water jug, we keep our toiletries like toothbrushes, face wash, and sunscreen. Our cooler is where we keep all of the food that needs to be chilled. We've been looking at upgrading to an electric fridge, but for now we use this cooler that we've had for about 20 years. We use ice blocks in a large container to keep the cooler cold. We find this to be much better than just dumping ice cubes into the cooler as those melt and then they get everything wet. We refill the containers with store-bought ice cubes if we need to. The far right of the kitchen area is where we keep our bigger tools like a hatchet, saw, and mallet. We have LED light strips set up in both the front and back sections of the camper, so it's easy for us to see at night. The Honda Pilot also comes with extra storage space under the trunk where we keep additional emergency supplies and a spare tire. And if you're wondering about our toilet and shower situation, we have that covered too though we'll save those intimate details for a future video.